YouTube? Welcome back to American Dilly Man. Today I'm jumping into a brand new reaction video from the homeboy Burden. Now, Burden just dropped a song. He just dropped a diss record. A diss record, man, on Caskey. Now, don't get me wrong, man. Am I allowed to say this? I think I am. I'm allowed to my personal opinion. I like both these dudes, man. I'm from Florida. I done seen both these dudes come up. I done enjoy both these dudes' music. But I understand the inner workings behind the scene and how sometimes things can happen. Burden has put out some speculations that I don't know if they're fact, okay? But he has stated it. You know, he feels like Caskey took a record from him one time or a concept for the record. He feels like Caskey been hating on him for a while. And then, then they swept that all under the rug and then Caskey of course y'all know Caskey just put out a brand new project with Yellow Wolf they got the whole project coming but they've been doing a lot of work together now he's fe he feels he's coming back man and he's gonna try to like 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 slick this well Burden ain't having that Burden ain't having that so it seems it seems like Burden dropped first it seems like Burden was not worried about it and he was like look man I'm gonna drop first I'm gonna drop my song on Valentine's Day and I'm gonna ask Caskey hey boy you wanna be my Valentine I think that I think that's hilarious <laughs> I think that's hilarious for him to do that but then drop the song drop the record let's jump into this man because I'm excited, man. I am excited. One thing about hip-hop music, I love when the artists do go at each other. It's like an MMA fight with words, okay? But I love collaborations too, man. I am, no, I am not advocating for beef, but I enjoy it when they do it. It's like sport rap, okay? That's just where I'm going with it. But I love collaborations too. Unfortunately, it doesn't look like these two are going to get on the track and do any more records together. With that being said, man, let's jump into Burden's new record. Dang. Dang. Dang, we gonna take that back, man. We gonna take that back. I'm gonna up the audio a little bit. It seemed like Burden on this best rapper since Shady's out. He, he put Gasky in the beginning of the record. Oh, he took the audio from, oh, oh. Oh. So you want to smoke a bitch? We're coming to dope a bitch. You was on live, say your name, you already know the bitch. Calling me out was all about cloud. Now we got to go the bitch. See y'all like a pound, you went to the ground and tear the throne. The don't get no voice. Your whole career is built on coast signs. Ooh. Ooh, he came in. He came in hard. He coming in hard, and he's spitting. I love this artwork, man. This is funny, too. He's sitting on the toilet right in his rap. He's got Febreze and, like, I like Burden, man. Burden knows how to make something funny when he's talking about things. So that's that's one thing. That's one thing. But man, he's coming in quick. He's saying, "Kasky, man, Kasky, yo, are you calling me out? It's all about clout. It's got to be all about clout, man. Seriously. And it is weird. It is weird, man. I thought that was I thought that was under the rug, and everybody's just going about their lives. Nah, man. Obviously, people don't forget. People don't forget. Oh, it was all about clout. Now we gotta go. Woo! He spoke on that. He said, your whole career built on cosines, little boy. Oh, oh, oh. Like I said, man, I like both these guys, man. But dang, dang, beef always seems to bring out the most nastiest insults, man. Nasty. Ooh. Oh, he, there it is. There it is. He spoke on it. He spoke on the record, the record concept being stolen. He spoke on that right there. He also threw fucking, he, he threw stones, man. He threw stone right there. Oh, you want cash money? You ain't got no cash money. And how come they ain't put your, their artists on your projects? Cause you trash dummy. That's what he said. Like, oh, oh, he trying to, he trying to hit him where it hurts. I'm, I'm digging the cadence, man. I'm digging the cadence in this, and I'm digging the beat. I'm digging the beat. Jeez, whoo. Mm. 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 What? He's saying he 
he coming for your career. Oh, he said he put any sending anthrax to your jaw. Open it, open that package, buddy. Oh, oh, and then he want to call him Yellow Wolf Jr. Oh, saying you always gonna walk in this man's shadow. Oh God. God, man, I'm telling you, he hitting him hard. He hitting him hard in that, like, that career line. You know, nobody wants to feel, like, less than what they are. All these artists put, they all put so much work into what they do. Nobody wants to be criticized for it. So, like, jeez, jeez, man, he, he, he. <laughs> but it's too late. You ain't walking savage. I'm sending that racks to your front door. Coming up in the pit. Look at Yellow Wood Jr. You will always be in his shadow. Matter of fact, you will always be in my two by the time we done with this battle. <laughs> you better respect it and call him daddy. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. They had it back then. I thought this was all under the rug. I'm, I'm, I'm from Florida, man. I love all these Florida boys, man. I love what they do, man. I love how they put it down. But like, like, seriously, seriously, it's almost like this came out of nowhere. You know what I'm saying? Everybody's doing their stuff, but it's like, it's like he had to, he didn't forget. He didn't forget. And he wanted to get slick on live. Well, Burden done came back on, on the track, man. Burden came back on the track, dude. You waited three years to stick your chest out. Read the comments, pussy. Stick your fan base, you out. Who'd you think you was playing with? Fuck, boy, you know how I get down. And if you're mad about this, this bitch, next time you win town. Ooh. You know, all your comments. When someone mentioned up church, LMAO, Bobby, he'll take you out in the hearse. But why would he be for mentioning the name of someone his fans never heard? Bitch, I don't care if you bring it. I ain't no man of my word. You better than Ooh, you. Ooh, burden dropping names, too. Talking about how, how, cause that's speculation out there too. That's speculation out there too that Caskey wanted to put, put some shade on church and church's career. Caskey done spoke on that. Ooh. Dude, Caskey coming, Caskey coming personal and factual in this, man. It seems like he's got his facts backed up. He done, he done lit, listed it all out and he's letting the fans know what his grievances are. I think this is this is an awesome diss track. He's he you got a tight beat, you got an awesome cadence. He's coming out with the facts, man. He's not it, there's no like filler in it. I haven't heard a single filler bar where he's just talking some you know creative dumb stuff. No, 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 no. It seems like he's coming with the facts, all facts. Church, LMAO, what's your reply? He'll take you out in the hearse. He be even mentioned the name of someone his fans never heard. But don't <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, see that? See that? Caskey done wanted to say, Caskey done came out and said that he feels that him and Yellow on this project are the best since Shady. Now, I understand a lot of rappers have said things like that, and it is articulate. You know what I'm saying? It's an artistic form of expression for them to say that, paying homage to somebody who came before them. I understand that. But I think what drove it deep was the fact that he did go on live talking about this man right here. I think he, I think that's what drove it deep. That's what drove it home. I think everybody could have looked at it as artistic expression until he came out and he's trying to go at all these other rappers trying to, you know what I'm saying? And there's a lot, dude, there's a lot of good people out there, man. You gotta, you gotta understand and no, man, look, numbers don't lie, y'all. Numbers don't lie, so when people come out and they're just trying to like, it's like a clout chase. It gets, it gets frustrating. It gets frustrating for the fans, and. Ooh. Ooh.
Ooh. think about that diss track man do y'all think burton's coming hard do you think he's justified in the way he's coming hard he just done said at the end of the song cast got 24 hours to respond to this otherwise he gonna move on and just declare it a victory mm. insanity he said last time they went at it he didn't respond so he's gonna give him a chance this time and figure it out but he don't want he don't want to deal with that uh, that Instagram all that live talking rah 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 rah. A lot of rappers just want to do that rah rah. He's like put it on the put it on the beat, man. Put it on wax and let's see what we can do, <sighs> dude. I like this I like this track. I ain't gonna lie, I like this track, man. Me and Tim from Table Talk Time we were talking about. I think in 2021, Burden has definitely got a bright fruit you coming. He does. So with that being said, we're gonna see. We're gonna see. He's already dropped another song this year. Messages to America. Um, we did the reaction video for that. Now, like I said, I think that was a pure message. I think this is a pure message. Burden seems like he's always coming with the facts. So with that being said, whew, time will tell. Time will tell. Man, if y'all like this video, leave me a like, subscribe down bottom, and a comment. Comments are always accepted, man. I like all the comments because that means we can exchange ideas like human beings and just talk. Talk about the music. Talk about the artists we know and love, right? That's how it is, man. With that being said, this was American Dilly. I am American Dilly. And until next time, stay safe, America. I'm signing off. It's America.